My name is Hiroki Matsuchi, and you are listening to Tsunami, a weekly showcase of a single content creator in Japan and their content. This is episode number two, and today we are featuring a young, cool, fast talking guy who trawls the streets of Tokyo, getting music recommendations from strangers on the street. It's a simple premise, but he does a really great job of finding some really interesting people to talk to.、Um, and he also gets, of course, some great music recommendations from them. But to be honest, that's not the real reason why you watch his videos. It's the incredibly colorful cast of characters that he encounters along the way and the conversations he has with them in these very interesting situations that makes his videos so interesting. So、uh, here's an interview with. I'd say maybe one of his more colorful <laughs> characters. It's a bit tough, but I'll try to cut out the bits that would make this podcast rated R. Please take a look. Welcome back to Tokyo Trawler. <laughs>、um, welcome back. Uh, we're here with a young man ready to tell us about his musical taste that he recommends to the world.、Uh, <laughs> first question we got for this young man is What is your name? Yo, my name is Johnny. How are you going? They're, they're going maybe they're going fine.、Uh, tell, us, <laughs> tell us a bit about yourself. What are you doing in Japan?、Uh, yo, I work for,、uh, I guess, like Got Fitted Japan and stuff. We've got a podcast and stuff. And,、uh, Yo, we got some beers coming up this way right here. Sweet, Hold、sweet. on a second. Oh, nice. And、uh, basically, we do a podcast. What's the podcast? What's the content? The podcast is Got Fit in Japan. And basically, what we do is like two dudes, booze, Japan in the news. <laughs> There's that rhyme.、Uh, so, how it goes. Sounds good. Okay, well, tell us about the song. This is, this is the true message of this、uh, interview tonight. We want to know a song that you recommend. To the people of Tokyo and the people of the world, like this song must be essential. Essential. Like, you have to think hard and long and hard about this. You're on the spot now. Tell us the song, tell us the artist. Well, there's an essential song, I'd have to say it's got to be that、like、crazy Ken band. Make you feel okay. Well, make you feel like drinking more too, sometimes too. <laughs> Is it possible to pick up 37 girls in one night after listening to this song? Absolutely not. <laughs> really? Why not? Dude, there's no way you can pick up 37 girls in one night. Okay, we're moving on to the last section of this. We've heard a lot about that song. We're feeling good about it. Feeling 37 degrees hot about that song. But we want to know how essential is this song? How much do the people of Tokyo and the people of the world, looking through that camera lens right there, how much do they need this song on a scale of zero to five? We need a message. But I gotta say, for tonight, everybody, GotFittedJapan.com. It's all good. Whatever. It's cool. It's cool. Just enjoy it. Watch it. See it. It's cool.、And、if you don't like it, it's cool too. Enjoy. <sighs> <laughs> wow. I'll just stay a bit, a bit away from the mic. The host of the show, James, does a pretty good job of sticking to his script, but he does branch off from time to time.、Uh, he's very good at establishing a good rapport with his guests and ad libbing. Uh, when the people he's talking to kind of give him something to work with, he's definitely got a knack for getting people to open up in front of the camera, which I think is it's quite difficult to do and it's quite rare.、Uh, here is one example of that.、Um, here is a Bob Marley fan from France doing his absolute best to give his music recommendation and explain why he likes the song so much. Take a look. Hi, everybody, I'm Pierre from France. I'm in Tokyo for make some kind of carpentry.、Uh, my song is Bad Cop from Bob Marley. Enjoy. Okay. Bob Marley song. Why? Because Bob. That's all. Because Bob. Okay. Well, what color is this song? What color? Yeah.、Um, uh, like the Portuguese flag. The first time I heard this song was in Portugal. So green and red. Okay, like the Portuguese flag. Interesting one. Okay, and can you, can you give us the face expression that you had when you first heard this song? <laughs> okay, I think we got enough. There we got enough. We got enough. 
Okay, and how often do you listen to the song? Um, not so much, but maybe once a month. Okay. Why do people need this song so much on their iPod? There's because, because, uh, some kind of um, mesa message of being faithful, keep the faith and be courageous. To be faithful and courageous. Is it a song you can, you can play whilst you're making love? Sorry? Is it a song you can play whilst you're making love to a woman? It's not a love song, no. Uh, okay, not a love song. What kind of song is it? Is it a dance floor song? Is it a relaxing? A kind of rebel song. Okay. Bob against the world, you know. Bob against the world. Don't judge me, don't... like this. Okay. Uh, what emotion do you feel when you listen to the song? You know, I'm not speaking very well English and I don't understand very much. Very well, sorry. So, I only heard the music and feel the music, not the, really, the lyrics. Uh, that kind of... it's kind of cool cool stuff and make me feel of, make me remind some good feelings when I was in vacancy holidays in Portugal. Okay. Uh, what, what instruments do they use in the song? Yeah, guitar, you know. Uh, that's enough for us. Can you give us an air guitar for the song? Air guitar, oh, that's a trap. <laughs> <laughs> You're on the spot, come on. <laughs> so not after a bit. Yeah. <laughs> this is fantastic. That's fantastic. That is perfect for us. Okay, now we need the rating. <laughs> well done, by the way. Rating for bad car. We need the rating one to five. How much do people need the song? One to five. Uh, yeah, five. Why? Because it's Bob. Okay, that's enough. And give us a message about the song. Tell us why we need it or why it's so special, how it makes you feel. English, French, Spanish, Chinese, Japanese, any language. C'est une putain de chanson faite par un putain de mec. Just enjoy. Just enjoy. Okay, that was Toko Chola again for the evening. Thank you and thank you. Now, I don't know exactly how he goes about singling out people on the street, but I'm guessing that he specifically targets the non-Japanese population when looking for an interviewee. His interviews are edited down very well, um, I might add, uh, to only a few minutes per episode, and he does a really great job of sticking to the point, keeping things pretty tight. Watching his episodes really are kind of like eating candy. It's really easy to go through his entire queue in just one sitting. So uh, here's one of my personal favorites. Some lovely Brazilians recommending one of my personal favorite songs of all time. Let's take a look. Andrea. I'm Andresa. I'm Camila, and we are all from Brazil. And you're spending one week holidays in Tokyo. Okay, guys, welcome to Tokyo for your one week holiday. Fantastic city, isn't it? Thank you. Yeah, yeah it's, it's amazing. amazing. It's great. Great. Yeah. Okay, um, what's the name of the song? What's the, what's the artist's name for the song you're going to recommend to the people of Tokyo? The song is Garota de Ipanema. It's a Brazilian song from Tom Jabin. Okay. Yeah. Is yeah. it a popular song in Brazil? It's very popular. It's very well known. It's like something that characterizes Brazil. So it's pretty much, if you're here, Carreta de Panema, it's all about Brazil and what's yeah, all around. The, yeah. the English version is Girl from Ipanema. Yeah. Girl from Ipanema. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Ipanema is a place in Brazil? It's a beach in Rio de Janeiro. A beach in Rio de Janeiro, okay. Uh, um, how does this song make you feel when you listen to it? Well, I think it, it makes you feel relaxed and calm. It's a very nice rhythm. It makes you feel, like it, I think, relaxing. And that's the way you feel as well? Yes, yeah, yeah. very busy. Very happy. Yeah. Uh, you guys are quite famous for your like dancing and your rhythm and stuff. Yeah. Um, is this a really dancey song with a nice beat? No, no. It's something no. you listen and relax, like at home or something. Yeah. So why do you think the people here would love it? Uh, the rhythm. The, the rhythm. The, uh, the lyrics. And the lyrics are great, really too. Nice. It's wow. about Brazil. Really That's what you need to know about Brazil. Yeah. We need to know about Brazil? Yeah. Okay, right. The energy in the song. I'll start doing my research. Um, um, okay, the next thing we need from you guys is the five-star rating. How much does this, the people of this city need this song in their iTunes collection? How much? Five. five. <laughs> wow. wow, you guys said five. Five, yeah. Wow.
<laughs> that, that was resounding. Um, okay, the last thing we need is a message. Who's going to give us a message to the people of Tokyo about this song? Escute Bossa Nova. Okay, uh, I agree with whatever she said. Great. Uh, okay, thank you guys. Enjoy the rest of your time in Tokyo. That was Tokyo Trawler. Good night. Now, Tokyo Trawler is still in its infancy, and there really are a lot of different directions James could take the show in the future. The man on the street style interviews could be adopted to pretty much anything, anything beyond、uh, music recommendations. I'd be very curious to see where he decides to take the show in the future, if he decides to branch off away from music.、Uh, he certainly got the charisma in front of the camera, as well as the personality to make it work. His videos seem very natural. So、uh, please check out his videos on YouTube and let him know what you think. I'm sure he would accept any criticism with open arms. And、uh, that's it. Thank you for watching episode number two of Tsunami. Please get in touch with us with any comments, questions, or suggestions for future content creators on the show. But for now, I'm Hiroki Matsuuchi, leaving you with a few final words from two lovely guests on the streets of Tokyo on Tokyo Trawler. See you guys next week. When I go to party, just be, when I walk、uh, before entrance in club, sometimes I'm listening it, and I have a drink with friends. It's cool to listen it, and after it, and we're ready to party.